Hello everyone, Scott Sullivan Bell coming to you live from Coronado, California. San Diego's over my shoulder, somewhere over there. Hey, it's December 13th, 2014. I want to talk to you about speed, the, the pace inside of a sales call. Now, there's a couple ways that this can go. When you're in a sales call and you're in a sales struggle, it typically feels like everything's dragging on, so everything is sped up. Now, the buyer, the client, the person that you're dealing with can feel that because it doesn't seem right. They're on a certain pace, and then the salesperson over here is on a totally different pace and it creates some challenges, it creates a mismatch. So what happens is that buyer's thinking, okay, why is this person trying to speed through the process? And the salesperson's going, why is the, the buyer trying to slow everything down? And it creates a huge challenge, it's a huge mismatch. And I see this a lot with salespeople, it's like they don't understand why they lost the sale. They're like, I don't get it. I went through and I did my entire sales process. And they didn't get the sale because they sped up through the sale and they created their own challenge and they created their own issue that's gonna cause them to get an objection in the end. So then what happens is they try to speed through the objection and then they get to the end and they hear, I wanna think about it. And the reason that they were heard that I wanna think about it is they took elements out of their presentation or they sped up their presentation and they were impatient with the buyer where it should have just been in pace and in time and it really wouldn't have been that big of a deal, but they created their own challenge, okay? So every sales call has its own pace. It's like its own rhythm, its own music for the sale. And it could be like a really fast beat, 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 or it could be really slow depending upon the person that you're with. So you're gonna to wanna to do what you can to match the other person's tempo. So some of those would be like in the, the realm of mirroring. You're gonna to wanna to mirror their speed. It's not just like, their, their pace of talking is mirroring everything that they do, how fast they come to making a decision, how fast you're talking to them, how fast you mirror their body language. But remember that there's a certain pace or a certain speed to your, your sales presentation that you need to follow. Otherwise you start speeding up and it creates a huge challenge because then you start missing out elements and then you've got to go into quick discounting mode to try to get the sale. And then you end up losing the sale to somebody who didn't go through the quick process and they made it really easy, okay? Now, if you could do a small favor for me in the box down below, leave a comment, question, or story, that'd be fantastic. To the right or to the left, the button right in here, there's a subscribe button, subscribe. And then you can know you can send it out to all your friends via StumbleUpon, Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Scott Sylvan Bell. Only Scott Bell will Sylvan, we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching, aloha.